Hi, I'm Brain with Ray Marine, and I'm here today to talk to you a little bit about our new Smart Drift feature coming in a future Lighthouse software update. So, when you're out fishing, you're bottom fishing, you're deep dropping, you're fishing for swords, and you've got a spot that you want to drift over, what usually you do is you're going to do a test drift, you're going to lay down some track, and you're then going to try and come parallel to that track to try and drift over your chosen location. What Smart Drift is going to do is it is going to calculate where you need to start that drift. So the way I do it is I can either pick a spot on my chart or I could pick a spot on one of my sounders. And what's going to happen is I touch and hold. We're going to select this wreck that's right behind us because you don't need to be right on top of it. You just need to be near the spot you want to drift to. We're going to touch and hold on this wreck and I'm going to say calculate drift to here. What we want to do is we want to put the boat in neutral so that only wind and current are affecting the movement of the boat and we're going to hit the start button. What's going to happen is we are going to do a test drift. It's going to be a few hundred foot test drift and then Smart Drift is going to tell us where to start our drift. This feature is also very useful for not only trying to drift over a certain area to fish but also for anchoring. If I want to anchor over a wreck or uh, I want to make sure that I'm anchored near that wreck, I can use Smart Drift. I can get my start point, start drifting back to my wreck, and about midway down, whatever distance I want to be from my wreck, I can start dropping my anchor. And then I can let out as much rope as I want, and I can position that wreck, whether it's right under the boat, right behind the boat, so that I'm in the best spot to fish that wreck. You know, Smart Drift is really taking the guesswork out of any kind of drift fishing or really anchoring on any kind of a wreck. You know, we're going to tell you where to start that drift, and we're going to make your day on the water that much easier. All right, so we're approaching our drift start point, and what we're going to do is we're going to try and stop the boat right on that start point so that we get a drift right over our wreck. All right, we stopped on our start point, and we're going to make that drift over our wreck. So there we are. We drifted right over our start point. We're drifting right over our wreck. It's really as simple as that. For more information about Smart Drift, head on over to raymarine.com or any of our social media channels.